Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. I received a letter the other day. It was interesting. They wanted to know if I ever heard from a spirit that spoke a different language. And I, I thought I had mentioned before, but I don't think I ever did in any of these uh, little clips that I'm doing, that language is never a barrier with the world of spirit. doesn't matter if the person never spoke English. The only language I speak is English, a little bit of German, but not much. But the only language I really speak is English. And it doesn't matter um, whatever language they spoke, if they spoke no English at all, if they only spoke French or they only spoke Chinese, it makes no difference because there's no barrier with the world of spirit. The information comes in, it's soul to soul communication. So um, there's, there's never a problem um, with communicating. And since, um, you know, like I explained, there's a veil between worlds and we form our own language, they work with us very symbolically. So it's very easy to get this download of information. I often refer to spirit energy as a download because like before I do my reading, any reading, whether it's a one-on-one -on -one or a group or a gallery, I'll sit down and I'll pray and meditate. And I always keep a journal in front of me and I'll get a slew of information that comes in before the reading. And I just, sometimes they'll show me a symbol, sometimes they'll say a word, sometimes they'll share memories. So, so um, every time somebody comes, I have information. And usually the first name that comes in, and usually it is a name that comes in, um, is the name of the person, the first name of the person that they want to connect with. Um, from the other side. So that's the way it works. So to answer your question, uh, language is never a problem. There's there's never a time that we, uh, a true evidential medium, uh, has difficulty understanding what they're trying to say. And again, I work very strongly with my guides, very strongly with my guides from the other side. So if there is something, if it's a, a soft vibration, if the soul is soft, uh, you know, I've explained to you before that the soul is your personality. So I'm a very strong personality, but if I connect with someone who is a very, um, very quiet, subdued personality, I want to make sure I don't miss any information. And that's where my guides will step up and, you know, I'll get it a little, in a, in a little stronger sense if, if they're giving it to me through a clear audience, which is the ability to hear. Um, or they'll show me a symbol or whatever. So there's never um, any difficulty receiving information as far as language. There, are, there is no barrier with language between spirit and soul-to-soul uh, -soul communication. Okay, so I hope that answers your question. And as always, I leave you in God's love and light.